What's good? YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Twitch. It's your boy, Mr. Siren, back here with another video. Scary XL video. And as you see in the title, it says Scary XL worth buying. So I'm going to break it down to you, in my opinion. What I believe that you can improve the game. And at the state what it costs, is it worth buying? At the state it is. Before we get into the video, make sure that click like subscribe to the channel and now uh, follow. Follow me and I'll follow y'all back and comment below in the comment section and express you know your thoughts and opinions also. So first the thing it's a huge gripe to me. It's minor, not very big, it's the stance. Say if I want to go turn around, right? Escape the opposite way behind me. It'll only switch me to the regular stance. And I feel like to improve it, either triggers left or right, just like double tap it and revert to the stance. Like, you know, revert to the stance you want to be at. Cause it won't let you revert or turn to another stance at all. That's one thing. Second thing. It's unresponsive sometimes. As you know, you can crouch with um, the right hand lost stick. As you saw down there, it won't let me do nothing. So it's very unresponsive but sometimes the game. That you crouch and pop with the left stick, and sometimes it won't do nothing at all. Except for you get like a little line, and for a bell right here, it automatically respond me to the spot that says session market at. Time I feel to spot if you have an option to put the session market back to the spot you want to be at. But like bell in general, it should repair you like you should reappear at that's why you build it just to keep the f uh, flow of the game better in my but that <sighs> um people do the challenges I had not done my challenges at all keep 100 <laughs> and some people say they beat the challenge hours so that the long to beat the challenges so it won't take that long it's the replay value of that might be up to the schedule if that's you know your main focus but the fourth gripe for me i can say you can't customize the height the size the face of the skater it only give you four options of skin color skin tone so you're darker so if going dark to have is just darker as hell. <laughs> Say no brown skin brothers. <laughs> you actually like to the So there's like a white, Mexican, black and pitch black. <laughs> um you need to add more uh, skin tones in my opinion. Same with hair. Add more selections. No clear Caesar and then you can have to believe, you know you know, more hair options also. Um the gripe with the hair, say if I want to select for instance, uh afro. You know how to do the hat that you wear, like from the back side of the head or the side of the head, or how big your hair is. I'm gonna put uh, a beanie on. It automatically kind of leads to sideburns and stuff. And the Caesar is not in the game at all. Period. <laughs> That's one thing, it's not in the game at all. And it should be for the head. The hairstyle you have won't show in the head. So you have dreads, the dreads won't be hanging from the back. 
you automatically put back for seizure. Other day is the question to the don't shoot. I mean, you don't get the shoes, but you need more options in my opinion, like more custom shoes and colors from each brand. Same with shirts, same with board and set colors on. They need this fist touches of that the shoes, especially the pants. I need the definite fix. Um, other gripe I have, so I had to do with creation, so all it's the glitches. The game glitch a whole lot, and just like session, you can bump into the smallest thing, your person be glitching, the camera be messing up, certain tricks that you have options like that, but for console, you won't. It's a thing that I hope to see in the future updates. Okay, the game. It's not a bad price at all, but at the state, it's a release it in with all these glitches and bugs and limit, you know, like, lacks a whole lot. And there's limit game. With other parts, even well, those other parts are small as hell. So no, you get good lines, but it's very limited. I know it's supposed to be other updates, you know, down the line of updates. But for releasing the game at the stage it is, it's very unresponsive sometimes. It's, I will be rare and if you buy the game right now, the same and get it, what happens to the game itself at the moment. And the other thing too that we like to tell the textures of the game. It don't bother me at all. I think the graphics is good. But I would say like you know how session had the textures with like the lightning, the water puddles, the small these with some updated textures. Have uh, pedestrians in the game, cars moving. You know, I wanna see like a live city with like people like this really is. <laughs> um since you see in the cover, they got other skaters around, the main skater who Tricking over the improve. And uh, this is my opinion and my opinion only. You know, everybody got a title to how they feel. I'm not bashing the game at all. There's things that I wanna see from a consumer in the other video. Like a couple of, well, a bunch of other videos like this of YouTube. I know this one today that come be out by Mason Storm. On his channel, so make sure you head him up and see his review. He might touch on the same things I'm talking about, and then it's completely different. Down to the glitch wise and their own responsiveness of the game, much work. A couple more options, more freedom of the game itself for customizations and escape different places. Like, they can add more maps that one day I'm like really hyped about, but let's expand to the map. Um, matter of fact, for the game that's spawning you far away, then you're supposed to be at the bailing, walking off the board, glitches, and all that, and some Tetris just really scared to skate. <laughs> I could care that me personally, I could care that spell challenge, but I just want to skate and enjoy my time. And one day I really want to see it's multiplayer. You know, play with, you know, the whole community. Awesome. The hell, you know, we feel like doing. Um, so make sure y'all like the video, thumbs up if you agree. Just like if you don't agree. Um, follow me on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Um, make sure you um, comment down below. And, you know, I want to see Easy Day. Studios, developers, game company.
just make you feel unpolished at the moment. So, this one is Sarah signing out. Peace. And the last, and in English is like that. Realistic, just the pops is too high at some times. Like for an alley. This should be high as hell sometimes. Probably out low as hell here, then you know, you expect it. But overall, it's a game supported by it. Copy right now. Um, hope y'all on YouTube and Twitter. I review. Yes, get XL. Um, hopefully after patches and updates, it'll be even better than it is right now.